Selamat datang. Welcome to Jakarta, Indonesia for Indo Defense 2018. Army Recognition is the official online show daily and web TV for one of the leading tri service defense expositions in Southeast Asia. Please give a round of applause and welcome to Indo Defense 4 is uh, the, the name of the brands of our products. The, uh, the products uh, that we produce uh, is our special vehicles that we started from the design to until the, the manufacture, especially for the military and then for the, uh, the special uh, disaster vehicles. The special of the specialty of the, this uh, vehicle is this is the light and then uh, almost of the contents in, a, in the Indonesian local contents. We have the, the sell, uh, sold the type of vehicles for the police uh, in, uh, institution. For the army, uh, we haven't uh, sold yet. Now we still uh, we have a new agreement with the Thailand to, uh, to be as a uh, uh, for the captive market of the our uh, product, uh, for the first time we will we will produce in Indonesia, and then and, uh, after that we will uh, uh, open the new manufacture facility in Thailand. We have uh, three of the type of uh, company for the G, uh, for the G forces is only uh, produced for the vehicles. So we have a uh, three of company: Jala Berikat, PT Rido, and PT Sabah. Uh, the as a holding, we have a divide to three. For the Veterido, uh, they produce of the face and the uh, helmet for the body armor system. For this type of the vehicles, this is a new configuration. This is not produced yet, so still a, a prototype to be produced for the next uh, one or two years. We have to testing to test everything before we produce it. Uh, for the amphibious is uh, uh, still a mock-up models but uh, the engine and the system is already on we still to analyze, analyze for the, uh, the torsion for the rubber track and everything in that uh, vehicles my name is Budi uh, Budi Murniawan I'm a program manager for this uh, vehicle the vehicle name is a P6 ATAF all-terrain assault vehicle this vehicle uh, built uh, for the tactical vehicle, so uh, they have uh, power to weight ratios about uh, 40, and uh, we uh, we design it uh, with 60% uh, for the off road and 40% uh, for, for the on road. We uh, built this uh, vehicle for the special forces, from army, air force, also for the navy. 
they have a very very light vehicle on the 2.3 ton with the power about the 142 HP horsepower. I, I will uh, introduce our uh, new vehicle. We call it P2KM, Commando Monocoque, because there are not uh, chassis from the armor that uh, can protect le level one. We uh, develop with the complete with the RCVS remote control weapon system, and also we uh, for the next development we will uh, meet this uh, vehicle for the amphibious. So we uh, we have to uh, provide the body shape for the amphibious on the level one on the lake or river, and then uh, the 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 tire. We use the run fleet in, in, in inside of the tire and the CDIS system. This vehicle uh, will accompany three uh, uh, passenger, the driver, co-driver, and the uh, gunner in, inside that one. This is for Indonesia Army, also for the export. All of the uh, type of our vehicle for export for the next year.